In this video I'm going to show you how to replace a starter rope on your starter recoil. Now you probably need to do this if it's snapped or if it's got tangled up inside itself. It's very simple to do really. It's just uh, take these off on the top, three of these bolts off on the top, and move them out of the way. Once you've slacked them off with a socket, you may need a spanner or a socket just to slacken them off then it should be uh, pretty simple to get off. There's two there. There's also one on the back here. We'll take that off. Just lift that off out of the way. As you can see there, it comes off. And I'll show you how to repair the rope. So now with the starter recoil removed, if we turn it upside down, you can see that you can find the string here, that the pull cord if you like, that's pulled through. So to, to replace that, if it's snapped off and it's still left in here basically, just take it against the, uh, the tension, we'll just move it away as far as I can. This one isn't actually broken, I don't need to break it just for the, the purpose of the video, but you would just get yourself a knife, unhook it out from that part there, pull it out, basically cut it off. So if it's against the tension like that and you're just looking to put a new one on that's frayed, it's just worth taking a clamp. Now it's, um, it's about six full turns against the spring is that. Just take yourself a clamp if you have one and pop it on. Some people can wedge a screwdriver in against it, but I don't personally like to do that in case it pops out against the tension of the spring. So we'll just clamp that tight. Um, as you can see there, basically it just pulls through here. So let's say that was cut off. You just burn the end of the, the uh, starter cord here. Create yourself a nice end. Just burn it so you can push it back through. Turn it six full turns against the spring. Basically pop your new cord through the hole here. Line it all up. Make sure you've got a nice tight knot and pull it back through. Take off your clamp. And then carefully, you've got some tension with your thumb. Just let the pull cord go back. Normally about two meters of pull cord that goes back in. Very simple to do. Now if you've got no rope in at all and you're not sure how far to take it against the spring, as I've said, it's six full turns. You can count them just using the notches. So if there's two on there's two on this one. So let's imagine it's half one, half two, half three, half four, half five, six, and just until it lines up. As it does there, it's, about, it's around six full turns where the cord runs out. That's plenty of tension again to spring to pop your new rope in. Tie yourself a knot. If you're struggling to get it through, just burn the end of your new pull cord and push it through. Tie yourself a knot. Probably best just to pull it tight with some pliers. Basically, release the tension using your thumb or your clamp. Basically, let it take up the slack. Now, if you've got a problem in here where, where the springs have come out, I, I thoroughly recommend that you do not undo this screw here because there's in here there's some high tension springs and as soon as you take that off they'll absolutely fly out and I mean when they, when they come out they can cause uh, quite a lot of injury if you're not very very careful it's just not worth it for the price of a new starter recoil you can probably find one of these on the internet for five or six pounds so if you got to that stage where the spring has sprung out you probably could rewind it and pop it back in as I've done a few times but for the sake of the money you're better off buying a recoil whereas if it's just the rope just tension it against the spring six times, pull your old rope out, put your new one through, burning the end as I've said, and then gently take your clamp off, holding the tension with your thumb, and let it go against it, and gently wind your new rope back round. It's that simple, it's a very nicely designed pull cord on the Honda ones, very simple to do.